Airport traffic rules in PSAT. Welcome. In this video, we will explore the safety rules to follow during aircraft refueling operations. We will start with the essential precautions for refueling and then move on to the measures to enhance safety. Let's begin with the essential precautions for refueling. The aircraft operator must ensure that the personnel involved in refueling are well trained and aware of their responsibilities in case of an incident. Only qualified personnel can perform refueling. The team should include a driver, one or more refueling agents, and a designated supervisor. The driver of the refueling vehicle must remain near the vehicle throughout the operation, ready to intervene in case of an emergency. The refueling personnel must be familiar with the emergency procedures in effect on the apron. Appropriate and functional fire extinguishers must be present and accessible on each refueling vehicle. The personnel must be trained in their use. Refueling or defueling an aircraft cannot be done in a covered area or while its engines are running. The refueling supervisor must ensure that a clear escape route is provided and kept free for all refueling equipment. The setup should be arranged to avoid any vehicle reversing. All vehicles and support equipment must be positioned so as not to obstruct the evacuation of people from an aircraft in case of an emergency. Now let's move on to the measures to enhance safety. Before starting refueling, all grounding safety measures must be taken. The positioning of all equipment or vehicles in contact with the aircraft must consider the increase in total mass due to the weight of the fuel provided. Special attention must be paid to refueling during thunderstorms, particularly in the presence of lightning. A shutoff command must exist at each hydrant refueling point. The refueling points on the apron must be clearly marked. 